Hello everybody, I am back with the daily puzzle for Intermediate Challenge. So without further ado, let's jump straight into the puzzle. This is one of the harder puzzles that we're going to get. This is white to play and checkmate in six moves. Well, let's see how we can do this. So the first move is a rook sacrifice, rook to h8. And this is the most crucial move to find in the, the, the whole puzzle. So black has two options. King takes h8 and king g6. Well, let's look at the obvious one. First, king takes h8, then white simply has e8 queen checking. So giving black only one option of king to h7. And after queen to f7 check, king to h8, queen g7 mate. Or king to h6, queen g7 mate. Now, the, the harder line is king to g6. After which we have e8 queen. So now black has two, three moves. King takes f6. Then we have rook to h6. And now he has three moves of king g f5. Then queen takes h5. And if king g5, queen takes h5. And after king takes f6. If king g7, then rook g6, king h7, and rook queen to g8 to checkmate. There's many, there's many other ways to checkmate, but this one is the only win that's the fastest. It's the fastest by one or two moves. The more accuracy, the better. So let's go back to the line. Rook to h8. So. King g6, e8 queen, so we looked at king takes f6, now let's look at king f5. If king f5, white has rook takes f5, black's only move is king takes f6, and then after rook to h6, black's two, the black has three moves, if king to f5, queen to h5, if queen, if King to g5, queen to h5 again. The same situation arises with the same queen g8 checkmate. Okay, so let's look at king g5. Is there any difference? Well, to be honest, there isn't a difference at all. This is also the same line, and white wins again. Now let's look at the puzzle for today. This is white to play and checkmate in three moves. Good luck solving the puzzle, my friends, and if you enjoyed my videos, don't forget to like and subscribe, and to the next video, bye-bye, everybody.